Thank you very much for the presentation. Well, I'll put your attention on screen to say how good your magazine is. That comes out regularly. But um, your, the exhibition that was shown, I went down to Barrow College, yeah. and you said there's a comment for me, which it is. Yeah. But I was yeah. told it's not a consultative um, exercise by the officers who were there in the National Council. Oh. So mm -hmm. what, I mean, a, a lot of the improvements look very good, but is it just playing lip service saying to you know, put comments down about like, like for instance did mention about speed limit. Um, I live off the Titular Hill as well and um, they said that's not for debate, that's, we, that will not change. So I, I just wondered from your point of view, and I understand your position of the county council as well, that you know what what comments will be taken into account to, to have any changes. Well we, we've had a lot a lot of consultations on the road schemes in Fairham. Um, we've had, I think it's either three or four exhibitions on Stubbington Bypass, mm -hmm. uh, Newgate Lane, uh, and, and various others. And where they require a planning consent, then you know, there are planning applications and the, the statutory consultation. This particular one doesn't require any planning consent. So the purpose of this, having you know, already run consultations on the principle of improving uh, the roads and capacity from Sedgensworth through to Fairham. This is more of an informative to tell people you know, what it is that's actually being provided and how, but it is very much to listen as well. And things like speed limits aren't set in stone, and it may be that um, you know, maybe with a dual carriageway through there, that you know, it may not need to be a 40 minute through there. That's something <coughs> we'll be able to look at at the time. And of course, in terms of the actual construction, you know, these are a lot of quite significant schemes running through that corridor. And I think you know, we don't have a monopoly on good ideas in terms of how they would be implemented. Because of course these are being implemented on roads which have already got traffic on. So that makes it that much more difficult in building a, a virgin road um, such as Newgate Lane South you know, or Stubbington Bypass when it comes, where it's easy to build a road without you know, causing too many problems on the highway. So no, there, there have been some very useful bits of feedback that have come through it. Um, it's, you know, that is essentially how it's going to work. There have been some good ideas and some minor changes made as a result. So please do comment and it, you know, it certainly will be looked at. It's not like a planning application where there's going to be a permission given. 